All right, uh, I'm just gonna show you guys how the overall function of the gun, this Winchester 1885, works. And so here we have the diagram, but uh, some people, some of you might not be able to uh, understand how it works. So you know, it's a lot better to see it actually moving. So you have the trigger, the trigger sear. And I guess you could call it a sear actuator that's connected to the trigger. And then you have the hammer and the breech block. That's right here. So and so when you cock the hammer you have the half cock and then you have the full cock. And the sear engages the notch on the hammer and that basically locks it in place. And when you pull the trigger, this it raises it's the front portion of the actuator, which tilts the sear back, and that will free the hammer to fall. And when you open the action, the whole entire hammer and the breech assembly lowers, and when you bring it back up, the hammer automatically cocks by itself. So that's the basic overall function of this area. Um, the breech and the extractor. The act, uh, extractor is also actuated when you lower the, I mean, uh, open the uh, breech block all the way. And so it brings the cartridge out as you can see. And the way that works is you have this cutout portion or the breech block which tilts or hits this uh I guess the notch on the extractor and so when when that hits it basically levers itself out like that. But that's basically the overall function of it. So it's very simple. I mean, there's only a couple, do uh, little over a dozen parts. It's not as simple as rolling block, but still very easy build. <laughs>